um, local resident. My family goes back here a few generations. I also am part of the Gowanus Neighborhood Coalition for Justice. I work at the local Community Development Corporation Fifth Avenue Committee. Before I even started um, with Fifth Avenue Committee, I met Joy. Um, and I went to a bunch of Fury conventions. Um, and uh, I became a guerrilla media activist. And I um, started to tell the story that nobody was telling with my camera and interviews. And uh, I had a public access television show for like 10 years. Um, and Joy was and Fury were part of that show, many episodes of that show. Um, in 2009, um, I went on a tour with Joy and her neighbor when there was still a house there before that hotel yeah, went up. Uh -huh. um, I got to see the Underground Railroad, the connections and the sub-basements um, in these buildings. Has anybody else seen those? Did anybody else get to go on those tours? Okay. There was more too that weren't, wasn't even part of that. Yeah, Not yeah. even Lou's house, but some of the other properties yeah. too. Um, the point is that um, there is evidence that exists under these buildings in their sub-basements. There were uh, cooking uh, areas. Um, th there's a lot uh, of, of artifacts that can be unearthed here if, if the decision is made. Uh, when they chose to build uh, that hotel across the street, the construction workers came to join. They came to join. They told her, there's stuff being found here. You know, they yeah. saw it, yeah. um, and Joy knew, she knew, um, and they couldn't get that hotel built fast enough mm -hmm. once mm -hmm. she was trying to point that out, you know, and then um, AKRF came in, and they write this very well-funded uh, study, uh, but of course doesn't have enough evidence to show these connections between these buildings, um, and that's a racist system in and of itself, because it's not using any of the oral history and the fact that who the residents were, the abolitionists that lived in these homes, okay? Uh, so uh, the point is that this exists and we can easily, if, if let to entryway into this building show that, doesn't even matter, as you said, the fact that prominent abolitionists lived here, there is a history, um, and right now uh, the the developers, these, these um, Creeps. Hotel <laughs> corporations, yeah. they're accomplices to murder right now. Let's be real. Yeah. Yeah. You're, you're eradicating history, okay? LPC should not be an accomplice to murder. So, um, you know, I just want to end by saying, you know, um, a quote from Joy, right? Um, first of all, she, a decade ago, was calling for a freedom center here in her own home, okay? Let's be real, okay? So we gotta fight for the Chattel and Truesdale Freedom Center yeah. to be right here, Yeah. okay? Yeah. And Joy always, always said, why can't we have a little piece of history when everybody else has so much? Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, Joy, it's, we gotta continue this fight. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.